burn no nigga, bitch, cause I'm from Dallas, Texas. If he flexion in my section, then we full court press on. Better shit. We here, episode 32, straight forward. Shit, back in the A. Shit, yes, I'ma start off. Shit, introducing shit. I'm Doe. Shit, aka the kid. Shit. Yes, sir. We straight to it. The biggest bro of the bros, Diesel. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and shit, we got a fucking. National champion in this house, man. Max. Like you said, it's a it's a great way to do episode thirty two. We got a national champ, fresh from getting back. Shit, I'm gonna say you was beating ass. Jeez, shit, <laughs> you was putting built the ass. That's what I think. Yeah. But shit, how you doing, man? How how does it feel to be back home? Oh, shit, feel good. Nigga, back home. Nigga, go see my moms. She was happy as hell. Oh, city really supporting the nigga. So that's 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 lit. Facts, facts. So, shit, we're going to get straight into it, shit. Seen you on the 4 by 4 this past weekend, shit. Hey, you acted a fool. Hey, I'm going to say that. They say when your head start turning, shit, the, <laughs> last, the last hundred, hey, just watch out, bro. Hey, so can you shit, go ahead and tell us about that race, shit. Really, I told my team, like, just put me in position and I'm going to handle the rest. Mm -hmm. Shit, them niggas put me in good position. I already knew, like, from the jump, I ain't finna go home with no second place. Yeah. Win this hoe. Nah, fucks so, with that. Shit, I just zoned out in that hole. Pass bro ass up. I kept going. I was like, oh shit. <laughs> got more on the team. Facts. Hey, so wait, we ain't gonna talk about this crazy split though. 43 2. Hey. That's crazy, bro. Hey. Yeah, I ain't got Olympic. <laughs> hey, that's how I'm gonna say. Hey, wait. Olympic type timing over there. Hey. Nah, for real. I ain't gonna lie, I couldn't believe it though. She was like 43 to 12. I was like, God damn. Like, what the fuck? Was this was it surreal when you like when you won? Talk us through what it was, what the feeling was when you won. Cause you in a stadium full of people. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? You in just Oregon. you just won a national title. Shit. Your name is on that forever. Nah, for real. So like take us all the way through your emotions as you was crossing that. Like, tell me about that, bro. So shit, coming down like last little 30. I'm looking at the clock. I'm like, damn, I just want to run like under three minutes. Mm -hmm. That's been the whole goal this whole season. Like, run under three minutes. Shit, I run through the line. I'm looking at that hoe. And I'm like, oh shit. I looked at the time. That shit's at 258. Oh, I, I just started screaming. I was like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> I was like oh, fuck these niggas. Fuck, <laughs> <laughs> like, fuck these niggas. Like, yeah. Bro, them niggas is like, well, shit, we was the underdog. We yeah. Didn't mention that like one time before the race started. That's facts. They didn't like, mention y'all before the race. Shit, shit. Like, niggas wasn't really expecting us to go out there and win. Shit, we had white boy on there. White <laughs> yeah. Hey. Hey. What did that do for you, being written off Man. beforehand? Was it like, you know what I'm saying? The chip on your shoulder? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, because you did get DQ in the I 400, DQ, too. So, so, yeah. Really, that shit had made me, like, turn up. Like that DQ really had fucked me ever. Like mentally, I was like, all right. I wasn't even sad. I was more so mad. Like, mm -hmm. damn, I got all the way here. I done ran fast, I done PR, and then they DQ'd my eyes. So shit, going that four by four, I went in that tunnel, I was telling them niggas, like everybody in that hole, cause we all go, each team. Mm -hmm. I just yelled out, I said, y'all niggas better run today. <laughs> oh shit. And they was just in that hole. <laughs> so, yeah, all right. <laughs> oh shit. Oh shit, that shit crazy. Hey, so talk us through. Okay, so uh, you come from SFA. I seen a video where you ran a four by four. You hawked a and them down, all right? Yeah. And for ran forty three four, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, and then I guess the year after you transferred. Take us through what what happened at SFA. Like, what how was it like there? So shit, at that whole bro, it's like two different culture shocks from a and m SFA. You know, SFA is straight black people, mm -hmm. so that might turn. Nigga wasn't really locked in. <laughs> I wasn't really locked in. Yeah. But I was running fast. I just wasn't locked in on my school and shit. But shit, I wanted to go to a bigger school, bro, just because get that experience. Like, I'm beating everybody over there. So I'm like, mm -hmm. let me go to a bigger school, get that that SEC experience. Exposure. Yeah, right. more exposure yeah. to it. Like, my whole goal for running, I'll try to go pro. I'll try to put my mom in a better position, which mm -hmm. yeah, got to work again. Should I transfer it? I had to sit out a year. Them niggas ain't want to release me. Mm -hmm. So I had to sit out a whole year. I ain't do nothing. I ain't run. I ain't do nothing. Yeah. I was just at the crib, bugging. Well, so how that affect you? Did you, what did you think about giving up? What was it? Talk to yeah, me. Bro, it's a lot of shit like that went down, like mentally. Mm -hmm. Like, and sometimes I was like, damn, do I even want to keep doing this shit? Like, a nigga ain't had no drive, no hope. Mm -hmm. Shit, I ain't running 
shit, I feel like I use running to escape from reality, bro. Yeah. Like, that's my whole goal for running, too. Like, that shit, a stress reliever for me. That shit mm-hmm. bringing me peace. Like, I just go out there. Nigga, I don't think about shit. Mm-hmm. It just, just you in the track. It's just me in the track, yeah. me in my own lane. Mm-hmm. So, shit, I ain't had that to go to, so that shit just kind of took me down, like, mentally. My brother got killed. Mm-hmm. Shit, a lot of my partners got killed. I lost my auntie. Yeah. A lot of shit was just happening back to back to back. I was mm-hmm. like, damn, I got to get to school. Like, I got to go to school now. Mm-hmm. So, yeah. What drove you? What drove you back? I ain't gonna lie. My mama, bro. Mm-hmm. I'm like, damn. Because she and my aunt, she lived a block away, like one block away from me. So we was close as hell. Shit, my mama had to step up, take care of the kids. Mm-hmm. Had five kids. My mama on her own. She got to take care of five kids, bro. So I like, damn, I got to help my mom. Yeah, it's time to, yeah. Okay, time it's time to, to yeah, it's time to go. I Fact. Go. Yeah. Fact. Got that plan. Fact. I got to get on my school shit. I got to get out here and run. Mm-hmm. So my partner was telling me, shit, you went to what, Colleen Forrest, Ellison? What school you in? High school? Clyde Forrest. Yeah, okay. that's, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. They say, hey, they say you want a state title there too, four by four. Like, what's up, bro? You you just a winner? Like, what's up? Shit, bro. I ain't gonna lie, niggas just want to win. Hey. Take us back to that time for you. Because that's, that's almost coming to like five years now. Yeah. Five facts. So like, does it really feel like five years ago? Does it feel yeah, like yesterday? No, bro. <laughs> Time is flying. Mm-hmm. <laughs> you think about it, it's 2024. You're like, damn, Facts, just graduated. Hey. It's 2024. Just graduated. About I agree time. with you. Well, that's like 2021 state. Shit, I was a junior at the time. All my partners were seniors. Shit, shout out to them niggas, man. <laughs> um, we wanted that whole bad, bro. It just like, we was the underdogs, just like, it's like an underdog story, bro. I've I been having that underdog story mm-hmm. forever, bro. Like, shit, I went to Klein Force, that whole 95% black. He ain't expecting no kids with no acres home, fifth ward, get out there and go run. Right? Mm-hmm. You know, fuck the state title. That's facts. We got out there, won that hoe. We, we, that's the legacy of history. First school in the KISD history to bring a state home, mm. state title. Damn, that's big. We won that hoe. That's so, big. That's, hey, that's big for yeah, self, for yeah. so. So, so, okay, so. Can you take us to the boy? What's your preparation like? Tell us what you do day to day. What's your workouts like? Talk to us. <laughs> yeah. I just be chilling like <laughs> niggas always be like, damn, how the fuck you ran something? Yeah, like, how are you this fast, like, bro? bro. Like, I be McDonald's. McDonald's. Bro, bro. McDonald's. I do believe that the Ocho Cinco uh <laughs> so, diet hey, is real. Before I ran that 43, bro, I had I had McDonald's again. I like bro, that's my go to. Ocho hey. was right. Ocho was right. You know what I'm saying? Like it don't matter about what you eat. Some people like, oh, I gotta get on a diet this and that, bro. No, you don't. You it's a bad boy. You got that dog in you. Nah, it really makes you got that dog in you. Like you go get out there and drop your nuts. Mm-hmm. That's the main thing. But shit, I be eating whatever I want. I be on the game. <laughs> be thugging, bro. bro. Chilling, like. So you said SEC. What is what is practice like? You know, in the SEC. Bro. I know that because you went from SFA to now SEC A yeah. and M. Right, That's right. a big leap. First day of practice, niggas put that shit on me. Y'all. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, y'all got in this group. My boy Eric, uh, James, bro, Marco. I got in that group the first time I came. Them niggas put belt to ass. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I her hands on knees. I'm like, what the fuck? I got myself. <laughs> so practice wise, that hoe is like totally two different things for SFA. Like mm-hmm. niggas coming this hard to grind. Like one thing I like. We all got that same mentality. We want to win. Yeah. Like the people I just ran with, my one of my homeboys, the um, third leg, he from Jamaica. So mm-hmm. You already know he got that mentality. Yeah. yeah. Facts. Hey, that's facts. So he, they got the mentality. That's, that's facts, he bro. He warrior, bro. He. He I'm, said warrior. Bro, he yeah. Say, <laughs> hey, part of a line. That's all he say, bro. Hey. That's real though. That's real. Yeah. He be like, bro, part of a line. Like them, the Jamaicans on my team, but they call me Big Man. Hey. Like a, <laughs> I fuck, I fuck with that. I fuck with that. I fuck with that. You the king, so they all call me that, bro. He be the main one. Okay. My boy, um, Javon, my first leg, he from the H, so you already mm-hmm. know he got that that dog. Yeah, dude. them Texas boys. And then white boy, my boy, cut. <laughs> he hang with nothing but black people. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he got to be a dog then. That's uh, facts. So yeah. Put you know all of us together. Put a plate in front of us. You know we trying to eat. Mm hmm. Mm-hmm. I like that. I like that. So okay, wait. So, what are you thinking about Olympic trials? What you you think about what? 
Uh, I want to go out there and, you know, put on. Mm-hmm. I want to make the team. That's, mm-hmm. that's like, that's going to be a huge accomplishment, you know, mm-hmm. going to Olympics. Oh shit! Potentially getting a gold medal. Yeah, like that's the the main thing. Like just going to Olympics, getting there. This mm-hmm. I don't even care what I do out there. It's more so, you know, getting experience. Like, hey, bro, I went to the Olympics. Like I'm an Olympian. Mm-hmm. I went there. I did some. I ran. You know, just do that. Not only man, I'm trying to. I got a little brother that's a senior. He running track as well. Mm-hmm. Going to college. I got to keep being a good role model for him. Thanks. You know, keep make sure on. he following the right footsteps. Mm-hmm. Okay, so you you run a relay, so clearly you on the team. I wanted to do a little parallel for a second. <laughs> who would you say you know that your role is, or who would you say you compare yourself to out of the NBA, like Jordan, Kobe, like Kyrie, fourth quarter take? You know what I'm saying? Up. Like, what is it? Who would man. you say it is for you? Oh, oh shit! He did say dog. dog. He did say hey. dog. He said hey. dog. I I. Hey. That's facts. He, he don't give a fuck. He roof. Yeah, like, he <laughs> facts. He want to be the vid of the NBA. That's me. Like, mm-hmm. on the track, bro. I don't give a fuck. What a nigga say. What a nigga think. Mm-hmm. I'm going to run against you and put a belt to your ass. Like, it is what it is. I don't care how you feel. You just going to have to be me that day. Yeah. Okay, what you did last yeah. week, the week before that, yesterday, you're going to have to do it when you race me. Yeah, because I ain't going to lie. I ain't going to lie. Uh, my dad watched track, and I ain't going to lie. He was watching well, He was watching me, and he thought, like, he thought, hey, he, he ain't even say a was going to be top three. I ain't going to lie. He been watching track for a long time, too. He, he ain't even say a and was going to be top three. But I seen your race. I seen you on the 400, the prelims, so the semifinals or something. Yeah. And I seen you running against, uh, what's bro name from? Uh, Riley. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That broke the record. Yeah, I seen you running against him, hey. I just know I thought you, hey, I thought just from the win now, I thought just from the take down to the career, but I ain't gonna lie. Hey, hey that nigga did me. Hey, right I'm here. telling you, I thought you were gonna take that to the career, bro. So wait, where'd you get the head knife from? The last hundred, bro. Bro, <laughs> <laughs> bro I don't know where I picked that shit up from. Like, <laughs> I don't even know. I did not used to do that. I be picking up all type of shit, watching the middle nigga do that. I used to be doing it. Like, damn, I be like, damn, I need to stop doing that. This shit turning you up though. No. Nah, <laughs> Let's talk about pregame. So, like, what gets you into that mode, like, before you go out there and walk on all fours on these niggas? Man, bro, I just think about, like, I got to put on for my family. Mm-hmm. Like, that shit turn me up all the way. Like, I'll just be like, damn. Who we banging, though? Who we bumping? Young boy. No. Hey. hey. Young boy go get I fucks with you. Hey. That, um, yeah. That baby kid. Okay. That nigga go get some time. That nigga like, fucking kill, bro. Crash, right? Like, Crash out. <laughs> I, bro, I had the whole team. Like, we all used to be in that hole. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> bro, I used to be in that hole. Like, we go crash out, bro. <laughs> that nigga right there gonna make you get in that mode for real. For that's real. facts. Hey, that's facts. So, hey, I put that nigga on. And shit, I get up there. I'm ready. Wait, so who your top five favorite artists then? I'm gonna go with Young Boy. Yeah. No cap. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, Tyler. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Like that okay, some car type shit. He like the other Tyler. <laughs> bro, he tough. He talk <laughs> shit, too. Like, <laughs> little young he nigga talk shit. He in that hoe. He, like, all his shit be rhyming. Mm-hmm. He saying his little shit. That shit cool. Uh, damn. I been on that. Um, nah, them really the main niggas I be listening to. Lil Tyler, No Cap, Young Boy. And then baby kid, I'll be on that nigga. I've been on that underground shit too though. Like who? The Tony. Okay. I'll be on that nigga. I'll be listening to that nigga shit. You know something about Steezy? YK Steezy or nah? Nah, nah. V's, V's, I've been on Okay, that yeah, I fucked that V shit too for sure. Yeah, a lot of my niggas they rap. My nigga Trail, Glue, mm-hmm. so shit. I'll be listening to them niggas for I run too sometimes. Okay, okay, okay. So wait, so what's your favorite race now? Shit, sad to say it, but I like the four. Ooh. Because in high school, bro, I wasn't even a 400 runner. Mm-hmm. I just run the four by four just because they wanted me to. But I shit, in my head, I thought I was a 200 runner. Mm. So everybody, bro, I run the 200. I ain't run no 400. Now look at you. Four. Four, honey. four. Four by four. Bro. Four walk down. <laughs> <laughs> I used to look like, coach be like, four by four. I'm like, oh, my stomach. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I think of anything. Nah. Leg her, I don't think I can do it. <laughs> he nah, need somebody. I'm like, damn. Get on that hoe and go run it. 
Wait, so wait, how do you keep your body right? You got 400 and you back down, four by four. Like, how do you keep your body right? I know you be aching, cramping, something got to be going on. Nah, bro, it's more so up here. Like, mm -hmm. You could be hurting. If you if you telling yourself you hurting, then that's how your body go react. Like, mm -hmm. You be like, oh, my leg hurt. I don't feel like running. That's what's going to happen. It's all in the mind. Like, you just got to be, like, mentally tough. Like, I feel like track that whole is straight mental. Like, everything mental. So if your mental strong, then I feel like you can achieve anything, bro. Mm -hmm. Not just track, but anything. Yeah. So I wanna I wanna go to the beginning of all of this, the beginning of the track journey. Yeah. Who first put you in track? Like, mm -hmm. where did it all start for you? Mm -hmm. It was really my granny. Shit, you know everybody growing up, everybody want to go to the NFL. Like, Back. Yeah. That's the dream, bro. Like, Backs. I used to play football. I quit football. Mm -hmm. I went straight track. But you play running back? I was slide. Slide, like, yeah. Back, both. But, shit, I, yeah, I had that NFL dream, bro. I ain't gonna lie, I did. Like, heavy. That's that's why I just wanna be. Wanna go to the NFL. Shit, seventh grade, my granny was talking about track, this and that, this and that. Like, I'm already fast. I know I'm fast. Mm -hmm. Get out there and go see what I can do. Seventh grade, that's where that shit, everything started. Like, the legacy, the beginning of me. Mm -hmm. Nah, that's it good. started in middle school for a few folks too. Facts, facts. I know that. How long did it take you to uh, give a football? I say like junior year, mm -hmm. high school. Yeah, shit at the homecoming. I just said, man, fuck this shit. I'm done. I'm finna go track only. Yeah, you know what you can do. Shit, I'm you know yeah. Straight track. Like, yeah, yeah. You know how to make it out. Shit. I kept doing in and out. Like you know, fall you be football, football, mm -hmm. summer football. But yeah. I'm doing summer track and football. Yeah, summer track is crazy. So I'm doing both. Then I come back, drum right into track. The senior year came around like, hey coach, I think I'm finna do track only. Like, <laughs> football, I don't wanna do nothing. I wanna straight track only. So shit, junior year came, after that homecoming game, I turned them pass in. I said, <laughs> cool, I'm gonna <laughs> run it. Shit, that's what it got. That's what it really got crazy. Like. Once I dedicated my everything straight to track, mm -hmm. came by my senior year, U.S. number one. Like, Damn. U.S. number one, two events, like back to back. Damn. Start away. Did you get offered soon as, as soon as you hit them or nah? I see, bro. So I say, like, if I could go back in time, mm -hmm. I would have took like school more serious, bro. Yeah. All them DC class, that shit do not. Yeah. Matter, bro. Yeah. They chicken as. Bro. Yeah. Like. Yeah. You can be good in them regular classes. As long as that GPA good, you good. Mm -hmm. That's why I messed over it. Like, I was in all them dual credit classes. But if my grades was better, I feel like I would have went to a better school out of high school. What schools was uh was coming at you? I had um, Iowa, Colorado, mm -hmm. um, SFA, Bama. Mm -hmm. I had, like, quite a few schools. But it just, like... Grades. Yeah, that do play a big factor. It facts. give you money, but it ain't gonna be nothing crazy because mm -hmm. your grades bad. So okay, what what advice you got? Say we got a, uh, I guess a high school runner out there listening. Shit, what advice you got for him? Shit, really, bro. Make sure them grades good. Don't mm -hmm. slack in the school. Like the offers go come. Mm -hmm. Times you know that's gonna come, but number one, school like. Make sure them grades good. That's why I say for sure. Make sure them grades. Mm -hmm. So I know you went from SFA to A and M. I want to ask because I know how football visits get in yeah. college. Get pretty, you know, interesting, yeah, pretty yeah, crazy. Yeah. So how did or how does track visits get for you, no, or at least your like, your experiences? Like they gonna get you turned up. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you feel me? They gonna make sure you have a good time. Uh, you know, you go try on the uniform, all that. But, like, the underground stuff, yeah, you go get turned. They go turn you up. They go mm -hmm. have a good time. Yeah. Every visit I went on, I had a good time. That's live. Like, for sure, I had a good time. Out of all the schools, which one you wish, like, if it <coughs> wasn't for this school that you went with, you would have went there? Uh, from the jump, like, I had just fell in love with SFA. Just mm -hmm. at the coach, Coach Mike. Like, he was cool, real cool, like, mm -hmm. It's more so for me. I gotta get a good connection with the coach. Like that's everything. Cause you know you stuck with them four years once yeah. you happen that portal. Mm -hmm. But I wouldn't even think about no transfer portal. That was more so getting a good connection with the coach. So 
I had fell in love with the coach, really. And then a lot of my little Houston partners had already went there. So I was like, yeah, I might as well go turn up with them. Did you always want to stay in Texas? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I yeah. want to come close to home, you know, just case emergency. Yeah. You know, jump on that road. That's real. Five signals, yeah, yeah. That's real. So, okay, so wait, I got a partner, right? Yeah. He, well, he, he ran D1 track. He took a year off, something happened, you know what I'm saying? Shit, right now he in the phase where he don't know what he want to do, but church, he a state champ. Like, he a state champ. He went to the high school, 6'8". He a state champ. Shit, you got any advice for him to get back on the track, man? Any advice? Bro, it's it's possible, bro. Mm-hmm. Shit, I had came to school, no far training. Mm-hmm. And shit, I PR big mm-hmm. time. Like, I came to school, zero far training. Like, I wasn't doing shit. Mm-hmm. Literally, I was chilling. In the crib, couldn't do nothing. I was just chilling. Shit, I came back, ran indoor, and I told the coach, I was lying to that nigga. Like, I'm like, <laughs> I'm like hey, I've been working out, coach. I'm like, <laughs> ready. He like, you ready? I'm like, yeah, I'm ready. And in my mind, I'm like, God damn, I got to race these. <laughs> what I got in me? Mm-hmm. But I kept telling myself, like, you ain't out of shape. You ain't out of shape. All the time, I knew I was fucking cooked. Mm-hmm. It's just the mentality, like, you got to get, get in that mode. Yeah. Fuck all that, fuck all you gotta just say, fuck it, get in that mode. Yeah. That's all I gotta say for him, yeah, get in that mode, bro. Like, it's possible, bro. It's it's for sure possible, bro. Okay, so let's say, you know, next Olympics, we gonna put it out there, you running at it. Mm -hmm. And Nike comes to you with a, you know, nice little endorsement deal. Yeah. Cut you a nice check, let's just say two mil. What's the first purchase that Ahmad is making? I put my mom on the house on the hill, man. Yeah. You feel me? That's that's gonna be the one thing to do. Like, shit, you know, everybody, that's your mama, bro. Your yeah. mama yeah. carried your way at nine, man. She didn't watch you turn from here to Jeez. here. Facts. You know, just to have that feeling, seeing my mama smile, mm-hmm. never have to work again. Like, that's gonna yeah. be a major feeling, bro. So hell yeah, he need first check I get, make a million, that's going to my dukes for sure. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Wait, so wait, so you go to the Olympics, right? Yeah. Do you, does it matter if you're on a relay or open? What What, what do you People, prefer? I'm trying to do both, really. Yeah. But you go get paid off either one. Like, yeah. You yeah. go make some bread regardless. Yeah. Whether you run prelim, uh, finals, mm-hmm. like you go make some bank. So. Gee, I hope you get there. I ain't going to lie. Hey, because what I seen, hey, you trust, you got to do you. Hey. What I seen, yeah, you for sure turned me up, man. I lie, you turned me up for sure, yeah. Who would you say is like the top five, your personal top five list of track athletes right now? Fred Curley. Mm-hmm. You know, he the villain. Like, yeah. He the villain. Uh, I'm going to go mix it up. Uh, Shakari Richardson, bro. Okay. He's like a villain, too. Okay, facts. That's facts. That nigga no allows. Mm-hmm. <laughs> that, that nigga was just talking about that. <laughs> I hate that nigga, but <laughs> go get out there and run, bro. Yeah. Like, go get out there and run, bro. Mm-hmm. Um, Christian Coleman. Yeah. A little like speedy. Too. And then, now that's really top four right there. Like, that I know of that just going out there and going crazy every okay. time. Okay. Okay, so wait, who would you, who would you say, I guess, who would you, who was your dream to get the baton from in the 4x4? Four four? I'm going to go fair and crazy. My all-time, like, who I want to run with, mm-hmm. I want to be, like, me... Champion Allison. Okay. Fred. And then Michael Norman. Oh shit. Yeah. I feel like that man. That's what I want right there. Like. Yeah, that's a bad yeah, that's a bad part right there. Facts. Shit, go ahead, ask him no loud shit. Go ahead, ask him. <laughs> go ahead, ask him. So like, what's your stance on what he said about the NBA? Yeah, as far was, as like the the state, well not state, but national champion and world champion thing. Bro was wilding. He was wilding. <laughs> wilding. Cause personally, I don't agree with it. It's just like I get what you're saying, but it's like, okay, bro, the best players in the world play in the NBA. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what like that's where they go to play. So it'd be different if if that's where the the best players in the world wasn't housed at. But like this is the best in the world. So yeah. you gotta say world champion, even though it's just played in it. Mm-hmm. What America is just in the United States, but yeah. I was like, bro, he tripping. Like, let the NBA be the NBA. Facts. Yeah. Right. Like, yeah, you can't wake up, go dribble the ball, go yeah, up. That's <laughs> go dog. That's facts. Yeah, like yeah, let that be, bro. 
That's facts, hey. That's so, real life facts, I right think. Right trying to go dickish and shit. They ain't got no business. <laughs> that's, hey. that's real. But he might have put the spark in Bron and KD and them yeah, he, to just go it. ahead and just whoop some ass right. before yeah. they get up out of here. Yeah, it's gonna get bad for folks. Yeah, it's it's probably something, but like for sure. Oh yeah. Bro had Bron tweeting about it. I said, okay. <laughs> he even, he even yeah. Hey. So now Spain, France, yeah. uh, Canada. Yeah, they could. They, yeah, they yeah. Gonna kill. I ain't gonna lie. You gonna kill? Yeah. KD. I say, oh yeah. You gonna gonna kill? It's the fact that Ant has the potential to come off the bench. Yeah. And you still got a D book on the bench. Like, uh, how do you guard that? You can't guard that. You can't. Hey, but the crazy can't. thing, like, the starters already go go crazy. Oh, yeah. do, bro. We, yeah. Bench go come off, go even crazier. I'm telling you, Team USA is stacked. Yeah, I'm this redeemed team part two. Nah, right. facts. <laughs> I don't feel like they go let up on me. No, nah, I ain't gonna lie. No, nah. Nah. I ain't so, no worse. Let's get back to it, shit. Okay, so wait, what do you think about Texas track athletes, bro? T- talk to us about that. Who do you think fucking with Texas track athletes, bro? Especially running in this heat, dog. Yeah, in this heat. Me, personally, I'm gonna say Houston really producing the best athletes. Like, Wait, yeah. Houston, wait, so Houston been in Dallas? Yeah. Oh, uh, okay. shit. Houston, the tank, oh, right? okay. shit. I'm gonna, say, I'm gonna say Houston, like, that's where all the dogs coming from. So y'all taking over. It's H-Town takeover. H-Town takeover. <laughs> for sure, for sure. Ain't good. So does Dallas at least have the football? We at least got the football. See, look. No, sure, it was busting Duncanville. Oh, uh, yeah. Hey, that's where you're That's where he from. Yeah. Duncanville. That's ah, where he went to. Geez, so that's like, where you're He changed and he changed. Yeah. The narrative changed. Luke, man. Luke. It's <laughs> last year. You know what I'm saying? They got they tapped. Last year. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They got tapped. Like, you know my nigga? My nigga AJ came down with you. Yeah. <laughs> Shout out to that. I like boy. how you brought that back. <laughs> that's my boy. That's my boy. That boy. Hell Mary. I seen uh the running back was actually playing in the league, the NFL. Oh uh yeah, he's tough. Yeah. yeah, Zach Evans. Mm-hmm. Yeah, he ain't too bad. But yeah, running in this heat, bro. Let's talk about that. As opposed to these other states, like, have you seen the major well, I know you've seen a major difference running out of state. Yeah. Bro, it's really it's humidity, bro. Like Yeah. Cause they done had y'all running in Utah. Crazy, bro. Yeah, we bro, we didn't been like visit crazy places. And it's totally different. Mm-hmm. The atmosphere like, put a big yeah, factor. Like you, yeah. Okay, it feel good. Like out in Oregon, it feel good out right there, bro. But Wait, they be saying Oregon track big. So is Oregon track big or what? Like, it's yeah, crazy. <laughs> yeah. It's a lot like, of money out there. In the middle, mm-hmm. it's, like stood around and looked around. Like damn, it's crazy. Was it packed out? Yeah, like not on the other side, like the mm-hmm. backstretch side. But as far as the like the home side, mm-hmm. yeah, it was packed out. Yeah. Only thing I say, bro, it was piling everywhere. Oh, hell nah. Alex, Sneezing people, and shit. Yeah, crazy. nah. I fucking hate that pollen and shit. Yeah, yeah, nah. That was the only bad thing. But as far as like the weather, it was cool. Like I wouldn't mind running that, having that type of weather up here in Texas. Yeah. Like, yeah. So you can't say, prepare nothing about Texas heat. Like, come this how you got to die running. So, yeah. <laughs> Used to hate summer track, man. Hey, I'm telling you, bro. Too damn hot outside. <laughs> I'm is, there all day. Is the heat worse or the altitude? Nah, I ain't got like that altitude. <laughs> man, you can't even describe that type of feeling. Man. <laughs> we went to Colorado before with SFA, man. We had ran an indoor. Mm-hmm. We ran 49. We ran oh. <laughs> oh, yeah, no. Hey, I thought I was moving. I'm, oh, yeah. yeah. Hell, yeah. <laughs> I was tired. Hell, <laughs> no. That was the funniest meet of my life. <laughs> like, we was laughing because we thought we was really moving the whole time. We ran slow as fuck. Mm. <laughs> The college, them niggas from uh, BYU, they were from up there, so they used to that shit. Mm-hmm. Texas people, we laid out on the ground, we coughing. Yeah. Coach giving a nigga the coffee. Attitude. Yeah. Bro, I'm in there, her breathing hard as fuck. I'm like, <laughs> bro, bro. Y'all do be laid out at the meet. Hey, I will every say that. time. As soon as they done, hey, bro, every time. That 400. It's, but it's hell. Tell it's you hell. Hey, it's hey, hell. Too. Tell you up. It make a man out of you. I'm nah, t- <laughs> it make a man out of you. Hey, so wait, so wait, talk about uh summer track. Wait, so were you a jump? Were you, did you go to Junior Olympics? Yeah. Did you win that or nah, 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 nah. bro? I never got to. Yeah, I ain't gonna yeah, lie. Yeah, summer track was different though. Some, hey, that's the way. That was too fast, hey. Like. Bro, I won my senior like my my senior year. I guess going into college. Mm-hmm. Bro, before that, hell nah. Bro. I'm telling you, summer <laughs> track, hey, hey, bro. I, you never judge a book by his I'm telling you. You'd be like, that nigga trash. Uh, <laughs> hey, I, this nigga's be fast in the bitch, like, You'd like, be like, that nigga trash. Mm-hmm. Hell nah, bro. Put that shit I'm telling you. I hey. licked that nigga one time. Like, I'm going to beat the fuck out this nigga. <laughs> he 
Africa. I like this nigga got a mohawk. He not. This nigga got a mohawk. That nigga came back. I'm looking at bro. I'm like, oh shit, this nigga fast. Yeah, bro, beat the fuck out of me. <laughs> wait, so wait, what's your favorite track story? Favorite track story? Bro, uh, high school, bro. I ran with some girls and <laughs> I thought I was cool in the bitch. Bro. Nips was ashy in the house. Bro. <laughs> yeah, yeah, bro, that's it. Really, bro, I ain't really got no favorite track. It's just, bro, that shit just fun. Mm-hmm. Like, Starting from high school to college. Like high school, you really going to the meet for the hoes. Yeah. <laughs> that's facts. Oh, look that's at all these facts. girls out here. Like, that's facts. You ain't worried about running that track. You really, I'm going to make that a girl. Because you know, high school, they go chase you around. You yeah, run up everybody, by everybody. Everybody. Everybody running around the field. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. You turned up. You, oh, yeah, I know she. <laughs> yeah. Oh, she Bro. see me running. No, she <laughs> see me running. No bullshit. Like, I'm, oh, she seen me. I'm trying to go spin on her after this. Mm hmm. Then college, it's more so like, all right, they see you. It's more so like the girls, they go off of what you did. Like, you got to be a slider. Mm-hmm. Oh, they ain't going. <laughs> like, you got to be cold. Like, they got to have known you did something crazy, but mm-hmm. oh, they not going. Wait, so have you had any work as an A&M was like, and you was like, oh, no, nah, I'm finna quit. Like, nah, this is my last day. Bro, before we had went, we, we don't really do no 350s, bro. We like. 200, 250s. Mm-hmm. But we had did a 150, 200, 250, 350. It was hot dinner. <laughs> Boy. It was 230. It's a lot of running. Know the sign, but hey, every time. Bro, it was 230. We came around that last little 50. I said, hell no. <laughs> <laughs> I, said, oh, I got it in. <laughs> looking at bro next to me. I'm like, damn. <laughs> No, he tired, because I'm tired. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that day right there, shit. I don't know how I made it to weight room. Shit, I made it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so shit, as we get close to wrapping it up, shit. So, okay, who? what can we expect from Amara Robson in the next 35 years, shit? Shit, hopefully I didn't. Shit, I'm rich, hopefully. Yeah. That's, that's the main thing. Yeah. Got some millions, some mm-hmm. billions. Went to the Olympics a couple of times. Yeah. Old medals. Broke some yeah. records. Hardware for sure. Mm-hmm. I'm just want to leave a legacy, man. Yeah. That's the main thing. Leaving a legacy. Mm-hmm. Got to be remembered. Yeah. Okay. Shit, man. This has been episode 32. We appreciate you coming through, bro. Mm-hmm. Congratulations once again. Thanks. Appreciate it. Elite company. Niggas not doing that. Y'all right. keep tapping in. We gonna make sure we put a mods socials in the description. Mm-hmm. Y'all keep fucking with us. We gonna keep fucking with y'all. Facts. And we gone. Boy, oh. pause before we end it. This is our first track athlete on the oh, podcast. Yeah. First track, first national, first national, first champion, national championship. Yeah. So shit, give him a, give him a follow, give him a shout. Shit, yeah. go fuck with him.